Hello, welcome back. Part seven. Um, right, where are we there today? Wednesday. Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. My voice is still going. Um, I've been talking too much all day. You've been teaching all day. So, uh, yeah, it keeps going a little bit deep like this. So, I go, yeah, if I go a little bit Barry White, bear with. Uh, we'll be all right. Right. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, also, the battery's back on on my phone, so I'm not recording the other camera. So, you just got to make do with me in the corner down here. Hello. Uh, right, let's see where we're at at the moment. So, I think when I left you yesterday, I said my next uh, part of the song was going to be to record the audio from the external hardware, which is the TBO3 and the TB3. I was playing it last night. <laughs> I've changed it again. Um, I've just decided I didn't like the TB3 line. I've just messed about with another bit now. I've, I've got to stop changing stuff. I, honestly, I, this, this will be it. Um, so, at the moment, I've automated on the TB03. I can see here I've automated the overdrive is going to bring up as we go into the uh, into the cheesy build up. Um, and I've just automated some of the other stuff. So that build up bit now sounds like this one's going to mute the new TB03 part for now. So we've got. So basically, it's just it's a static sound from the beginning. You can see it's all like that. It's going to be a nice chilled kind of thing. And then when it gets to here, we're going to automate up and get the nice overdriven Josh Wink kind of thing going. Build and build. And then okay, I'm gonna go for that there. Now I'm going to just automate then the second drop. Uh, I had to just start a new. I lost my um, my locator things because I get this. It happens every now and then. I don't know why. I come on. Um, I, I go back on. Hold on, I just put that as drop one. Uh, yeah, so this happened earlier. So I came on, switched on, turned everything on. For some reason, I'm getting stupid latency lag issues with the sequencing triggering the hardware. Nothing's changed on the latency. Nothing's changed in the thing. It just happens every now and then. So what I have to do is I start a new project and just drag everything in and, and do again, and then it's fine. I don't know why, you know, it, it happens. But so I lost a few of my markers. So there's drop one. Uh, drop two. So then straight after that, we're going to start dropping that down. I might be a little bit too extreme on that, but we'll see. So I want to drop it down fairly. No, no, not there. Hold on. Put a new node on there. I'm going to drop it down fairly sharpish. So. <laughs> Thank you. 
got something weird happening there. That's fine. the opens from the drop. The volume's going to come in a lot more there. So the other TB part, I've, I've changed slight, I've changed slightly, I've changed it completely. Um, I'm going to automate this from push. I like this this controller thing on push because rather than using the dials on the TB3, it does actually give me a dial for the envelope mod and the decay, um, which you don't get. You have to do on the touchpad on there. So it kind of makes it a little bit more like this. That's this um, this Protonica thing, which is free, a free Max for Life thing. So uh, go get it. It's pretty cool. Um, Right, have I automated anything yet? Don't think I have. Have I? No. Uh, okay, let's just have a play. So this new part, another new part. Just thinking. It's just going to come almost like an ARP kind of thing. It's going to go off on one in the drop.
knackers. <laughs> Excuse my language. So I've got the old pot in there. What a muppet. Um, right, hang on. <laughs> That's Cathy in the cross. Sorry. I could have I could have sworn them all. There was there was a lot worse swearing in the head then. Right, okay. Uh doke. Right, let's just get rid of that bit of automation. Oh you stupid man. Delete the envelope, not the clip. Right, here we go. Deleted everything there. Right, yeah. If you want to record something, you know what usually helps? Press the record button. Okay, here we go. Let's try again. This time with added record button. Here we go. I know what I'm doing, really, honestly. Here we go. behaving right so that's what it was
happy with that so far. We're going to have a, like a big whooshy risey uppy thing in there as well that will drop it down. I've got to use all the bits we'll do later. Right. Um, I've changed as well. I don't know if I mentioned this earlier. This loop, rather than it being continual all the way through when it's finished saving, um, I've just done it with a gap. So it sounds like this now. It's a bit. A little bit more of a rhythmic effect. Right, let's just have a listen. What we've got so far. First bit, but we'll bring it in there. Let's just turn all of that up a bit. Where are we old automation? <coughs> oh, oh, actually, I'll tell you what we could do. Right, let's leave that and put that back in, and we'll do. That cut off thing again to go up and see what that does because that's that where it goes that rhythmic -y thing. If you watch the other parts, you'll know what I mean. Uh, right, let's just have a listen when that comes in. <laughs> Oh, 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 
machineless going off in there. Uh, have I got such a thing as a downlifter in my results? I have. <laughs> Ooh, spacey. No, not, oh, okay. That's the, not the That's the first one I've listened to. I shouldn't really use the first one, but we'll give it a go. <laughs> Crap. Could make one, but I can't be bothered at the moment. Let's try it out. Is that a good old crash? A good old crash symbol. save it talking of crash before it crashes um <laughs> do, 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 do. oh come on hold on a minute Shouldn't take that long to load a flipping sample in. Uh, no, I don't want it. No, 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 no. Don't want that. I just want the the wave file. No space. Right, how long was? Oh, I'll go for that. Oh. Come on, why are you giving me that spinny thing? Right, let's go in there. Right, I'm gonna just call that down whoosh. Why not? Crash! I'm starting to get a bit all over the place. I'm not. I've, I'm not mixing as I went along as well. But uh, hey, you know, I'll, I'll sort that later. That's more like it.
Okay, so I've about got it where I want to for now. Because I'm ready for a break. So all I'm going to do is going to play it through. I'm just going to take another seven minutes because I've got to record the audio. Okay, the TB03 and the TB3. And I'm probably hopefully going to just commit that and just live with and work with what I've got from that audio. So to do this, because I didn't, you know, this went wrong on the other video. So I'll show you now because we didn't see it. So I'm going to put an audio track in below the TB03, which is that one, and the TB3. Oh no, it's the wrong thing. Nipple. Oh. Control T for a new audio track, not Control R because that renames it. Right. And let's rename that one as TB03 Audio. <coughs> right, so we're going to take the audio from, okay, so we're going to arm record it. And we're going to take it from the TB3, number one. Okay, so the audio from that is going to pass through that and record it. And we're going to do the same thing with this TB3. And then I'll just very quickly show you how I just tighten up the timing a little bit and just talk about latency. Um, so we're taking, where are we? This one is from the TB3. So if I now play it. We should. play the song through the automation will do its thing and we should get the audio recorded in those two right okay let's hit record sit back and listen to what we've got so far
Okay, so that's committed that to audio. I'm still going to keep those MIDI parts in there. I'm just going to stick them up there. Um, but that at least now means I can take this out of the studio. Um, I can work on it wherever, because wherever, I've got all the sounds recorded in there. So that's basically, I'm not going to put anything else in. Then Some stuff might come out of that, but that is all the parts. That is going to be roughly the arrangement. I think this first bit needs some work. Um... Okay, I kind of like it. I'm not going to change it anymore because I know I've changed it so many times. If I'm being honest, it's not the best thing I've done. Uh, I've still got some work to do on it at the moment. But what I'm thinking I might do is this video is probably going to turn into me doing two songs. So we've got this. The other one that I sort of scrapped, I think, has probably still got a bit of potential. So I might work on that one as well. And I'll, I'll show you kind of where I've gone with that one. So this is going to be a massive, probably about 20 part playlist of videos in the end. But, uh, okay, I'm just going to basically film myself working. And if you watch it, you watch it. If you don't, you don't. It's up to you. Okay, so again, if you've got this far, thanks for sticking with me. Um, that's it for today. I'll see you in part eight. <laughs>